Hi everybody, this is Abroke Friend. Today I'm gonna show you how to improve your performance in the Battlefield 1 open beta. Uh, right now I can't find in the config files, so you have really <laughs> you just have the advanced option. Um, I saw some I did some tests. I have better performance in Direct X 11 than 12. I'm running on a R9 280X right now from AMD. They didn't like uh, release any driver yet. I know uh, that Nvidia just released some drivers, so maybe test uh, between DirectX 12 and 11 if, if you see some improvement. But because technically you should see some improvement if you have an AMD card. So this is the first uh, thing that I have to say. Probably uh, AMD will release a, a driver really soon and it will be fixed. Um, yeah, so first of all, in basics, uh, I'm playing Borderless because uh, I'm, uh, I stream, so you should stay at full screen. Normally, you will get uh, a better performance with this. You have to know that field of view, more you increase your field of view, more you see stuff, so more you have to random, render stuff, sorry, and uh, it will decrease your FPS. So if you have a really bad computer, maybe you should uh, uh, test the field of view and reduce it. I have to say, the game is kind of well, like well optimized for the beta. Uh, I have a pretty old card, and I can run everything at I at 75 FPS, so that's pretty good. Uh, motion blur, you can uh, remove it if you want to. Uh, you don't like the this effect. Uh, I saw an, an, an improvement one to two FPS, so not that great, but uh, yeah, that's about it. So now advanced uh, resolution scale. Uh, technically, it should be at 50 for the basic one. Uh, if you go higher, you will see the performance are decreasing like crazy. So you can't, uh, if you want, uh, super sampling your graphic. And uh, I did a test for at 100. I went to 22 FPS. That was crazy. So uh, if you have some problem with your resolution, just lower it a little bit. But you will see a big decrease in your uh, graphic quality. So don't touch it if you don't have a big problem. For sure, if you everything is at low and you have like 30 FPS, you should touch to your resolution scale. Uh, if not, but don't touch it. Texture and texture filtering didn't see a big increase here, so it's normally one to two FPS for each bracket. Okay, so you should maybe test it on your side, but you will you're not getting like a lot of FPS in here. Lighting quality, I see 2 to 3 FPS for each bracket, so that one is kind of worth, and lighting, it's a cool effect, but yeah, you can remove it if you want to play like competitively, uh, it's not a big dive. And um, the only thing, they're saying quality and details of light and shadows, I didn't see a big, normally you have like a shadow option, I know it's a beta and uh, they don't put all the option, video option in the, in the, the game. But uh, I didn't see a big decrease in the graphic in the shadows quality in the game. So uh, this one you should look at it because if you put it at low, you should gain seven to eight FPS. So uh, yeah, it's a big thing uh, to test here. Effect quality and post processing quality two to three FPS each. Uh, again, you will lose some um, cool effect in the game. Uh, and honestly, I don't think it's worth to change it. Uh, depending on your video card for sure if you have like something i don't know a gtx uh, 950 for sure you should lower your graphic but yeah um mesh quality they're saying set the quality of mesh and eye settings uh, may reduce performance honestly i didn't see any change on my video card that's kind of weird uh i went to low to high and it didn't change anything so not sure <laughs> What is this? And anyway, you should test maybe test it on your card because sometimes the way your architecture of the card, like we have an AMD one, uh, sometimes it changes something, sometimes it's better on Nvidia, something is better in uh, an AMD. So you should just look at it and do your tests. Terrain quality this one is a big thing. I saw three to four FPS for each bracket, so you should definitely touch it. But again, you will uh, see a big decrease in your graphic for your in your terrain quality. If you lower it at low, you will see like you don't you don't see any details on the on the ground. It's not that great. Uh, underground quality, undergrowth quality. Sorry. Set the quality of terrain decoration and higher setting may reduce performance. This one same thing. Two to three FPS for each bracket. Definitely you should look at it. But again, you decrease your uh, visual quality. Um, finally, anti-aliasing post and uh, no, ju just anti-aliasing. This one is a big chunk of FPS. If you go to TAA to FX AA medium or low, or sorry, yeah, medium, 
uh, you will see 10 to 12 FPS. So this is a big chunk. And uh, again, it's a big decrease. But honestly, the FX AA medium, uh, it's not that bad. Okay, so if you're playing like uh, you want like your game to be quick and you're a Counter Strike player or someone who, who want performance bef uh, before graphic, for sure you should use FX AA if you have some struggle with your FPS. Ambient inclusion. This one I see two FPS for each bracket, so two here, two here. Uh, for me, I don't have any problem to running this game, so I just let it at uh, HBAO. Um, yeah, so that's about it, guys. I will for sure redo an another video when they will launch uh, for real the game, because right now you can change a lot of stuff. Um, and normally you have like some option for shadow quality, uh, no, shadows, shadows quality. So you can change a lot of stuff that they can improve your performance and it doesn't affect much the graphic. And in this case, we don't have a lot to do. Uh, people who have an NVIDIA right now, test that DirectX 12 because they just released a patch. I'm pretty sure it will be better. And uh, yeah, the, the, the game is optimized well. Uh, you see it's Frostbite, so Frostbite always run well on PCs. So yeah, that's about it. If you have any questions, guys, don't forget um, to write in the uh, comment section. And also, don't forget to follow. Bye, guys. Peace.